Okay, so we you're now in looking at a terminal that's in the root directory of the project, mm -hmm. and you know how to publish things. I do not. So I'm actually this is you know sidebar. I'm going to be learning too. Um, I'm going to publish on Andrew's behalf. Yeah. Because <laughs> so, I'm ignorant. <laughs> no, it's it's going to be it's going to be really complicated. Get okay. ready. Uh, so we're going to do flutter packages um, pub. Publish. And actually, there's an Easter egg in there. If you do publish, that should also work. Because <laughs> we're fun like that. <laughs> uh, okay, so publish, and then we'll do dry run just to make there sure go. there's any nothing. I like a nice dry run. Yeah, that's, that's nice. Okay, so that's our, um, we're seeing the outline of the things, and we have some problems. Uh -oh. Okay, so let's see. Um, we need to have a upper. Published or published packages. We can have an upper bound constraint for SDK. Um, we can add that in our little um, pubsec.yaml. Mm -hmm. And then we have some suggestions. Um, package doesn't depend on the parameter example. Well, yeah. Mm. So. Have we implemented? <laughs> We've implemented no tests. Okay, let's just, just remove take... the. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Um, excellent engineering practices. Yeah, in I mean, it's, I ran it once and it worked. What <laughs> tests do we need? Yeah. Really. Yeah. Okay, so let us go back to Android <laughs> Studio. And here's a here's a less like horrible way of doing this. Let's just comment it out. Okay. Oh wait, but we still have to do this thing. <sighs> okay, maybe we do need to. It's probably going to be. Uh, so I will say, when you publish things, there's mm -hmm. also a um, package scoring system, so that it can see how. Uh, oh, do you want to show uh, the yes. pub website just so Good people know call. what we're talking about? Okay. Yeah. So, um, Flutter Pub. So, so there's there's Flutter packages and there's also Dart packages because this is just the Dart ecosystem. Uh, you can specify whether you want Flutter specific packages mm -hmm. or web or anything. Um, and there are a whole bunch of packages. For example, here's good old Cupertino icons. Yeah, there were many of which we're already using. And uh, what do you know? It is written by the Flutter team. Oh yeah, Joe. Yeah. Um, and so there are a chunk of packages that are written by us. And oh, here's the score right here. Mm. Score of 100. Oh, I didn't know you could get a Good. breakdown. Yeah. So it's based on how popular are people using it, because you could write the most beautiful, well-tested uh, package, but like if it's not useful, like, then nobody can. Yeah. Um, health um, in, is involved, like how frequently are you updating it, and also there's like, it does some um, presumably code analysis of like, are you writing good style Dart code, or are you... Are you adding tests? Generating hundreds oh. of warnings anytime it is. Uh, and wild. maintenance. Oh, maybe that's part of actually the oh, tidiness. Errors. Yes. Um, and I will say so by design, these these are a little bit general because we're not we don't want people to game the system. So you, it's just like mm -hmm. these high level things that you you want to have published uh, packages that have good style code, um, but we're not saying it's this metric because then people could game the system. Um, so that's that package has a hundred uh, of a score. It's it's between zero and a hundred, so hundred is the best. Um, obviously, all of these are going to be really high. I can show you a package that I wrote that does not have a hundred. Oh, there Let's we see. go. Um, what is it called? It's called uh, Coverflow, I think. Simple Coverflow. That's the one. No, oh, it's all the way oh, down at ninety-one. <laughs> okay, Ugh. well, yeah. All right, so that's one. Is your tidiness uh, not up to no. up to par? Uh, yeah, it's, I'm actually curious. I, have, I don't know if I've looked at why. Uh, oh, a popularity's popular. killing you. Yeah, we can't all be very popular. Well, mm. anyway, so uh, so those are the things, and um, so this is doing back here is doing a dry run to see if we have these things. So what I'm as as we had this long diver, uh, discre yeah. <laughs> digression. <laughs> digression. <laughs> um, we. Uh, Basically, that was a long way to say that if we take out the test, it will probably get a little popular popularity score, but uh, we can we can deal with that. Okay. Um, so I've taken out these tests. Let's do another. Were drive. there two sets of tests? 
Oh, no, just the one. I just copied. Okay. I, uh, or I um, commented. I out. thought the example, I was, I was thinking the example might have had one and the ah, you're right. plugin itself might have um, had one, although I don't know. You're right. This is in the example directory. So maybe it's not even this test. Let's... No, you're an example there. No, that's, you're, oh, okay. you're right. But I think if we scroll down below lib here, maybe there's another, no? Mm -mm. It doesn't look like it. What am I thinking? I mean, this, this okay. did say it was example. Um, example test. So You're right. I'm okay. getting confused. So I think it's still going to complain about the upper bound constraint, but I think everything else should be okay. And then we can go add that. Hmm. Um, oh, look at that. Okay. Example test. Oh, we're not using Widget. anything involving tests anymore. Oh. So you can check out the import. There we go. And okay, so now we need to add our SDK constraint. And okay, so in that we're going to up, uh, open our pub spec. And so this is just information about the plugin, um, I believe. So we, we actually don't want to use this constraint um, because we want to say that it's valid for Dart 2.0, but I'm just mm. copying it to sure. have a starting point. Oh, wait, in environment. So do we have an environment? No, we don't. Um, mm -hmm. I believe we put this under... You can always go look at CoverFlow. Oh, good call. Cool. What did past Emily do? Mm -hmm. Let's Past look. Emily got things done. That's what she did. <laughs> Past Emily knew how to do this. <laughs> um, there it is. All right. So, yeah, it's just a standalone thing. Mm -hmm. We'll just copy that. That looks like good version yeah. constraints. Piece of cake. Okay. Good job, Past Emily. Okay. So now, let's try dry running it. And I think... What will it yell at us for this time? Will it say we're good to go? <gasps> Pub author, author and author. Author and homepage. Okay. All right. So, author. Andrew. Hmm. You, you transposed hmm? the D and the G. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. I said it correctly. You did. <laughs> Sometimes I get confused. This is very. <laughs> there we go. All right, and a plethora uh, of contributors. Yes, and, and homepage. Home page. You're just yeah, home, just do Flutter. Flutter.io Flutter for now. Okay. Um. All right. I think that's all. Let's try that again. I actually wonder what I put for my homepage. Mm. Don't remember. Uh, your post. But oh, jeez. Really? Okay, we need to fix this. This is a bog. I'm going to file a bug report after this. Come on, people. It's going to get out. We didn't, uh, you didn't fix the email one that was right below it. There's oh. another one. Oh, okay. Name, bracket, email. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Is it an array? Could you put in an array of... Okay, I can't do my quirky... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I did it again. I missed, but it's like, I can't. There we go. You no. just did it again. <laughs> there we go. Getting flashbacks to my high school graduation. Oh, I'm yeah. so sorry. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Let's try this again. Okay. Are we ready? Uh, sure. Zero warnings. Get ready. <laughs> <laughs> We're going live. With our moderately useful plugin. That <gasps> oh, yeah. Are we ready? Uh, we're ready. <laughs> Let's turn both the keys at once. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for your authors. Oh, yes. Oh, great. I wonder if we actually. Whoa, so there's like a. So this is um, showing that that you are actually uploading every half. So now. Oh, wow. We might not show this. On the yeah, we might we might actually take the rare step of blurring something out <laughs> here, which we don't okay, normally do. Good log in. I don't All know right. your password. But meanwhile, we can talk about. Uh, <sighs> look. <laughs> yeah, let's talk about. Everybody, pay attention to Dash. 
Dash is here. We have a guest appearance. Um, Dash uh, also is not the strongest on um, Objective C coding, but she is learning as well. Um, she is a fan of packages <laughs> and <laughs> long walks on the beach, <laughs> flying among two factor authentication. Um, yeah, two factor. <laughs> <laughs> As I'm putting in my auth code. All right, so pub authorized successfully. Okay, so let's go back to. That is, that is cool. So could we search for it? Well, hold on. See what? See if it actually went through. Go back but to. The, I believe anything that I see in a web browser. <laughs> I don't understand. But there might be another step. Oh, invalid. What? No pubspec.yaml file. What? What? We ha we just wrote one. Hold on. Go back to. Go back to um, um, Android Studio, where we were editing said pubspec.yaml. There it is. Looks like a pubspec. It does. I can zoom in. <laughs> did, Still did, looks like a pubspec. Did we, we saved. Yeah. We did save. Um, let's just, for grins, let's just try it again. All right. <laughs> I wonder if I took too long. Because there it is. Yeah. Yes, we are ready. All that build up and then we're I know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, really? Okay, yeah, time time to ask the internet. So I've had I see a number I've been browsing and <laughs> I see a number of solutions I don't like their options the the solutions that people have said is one was like I created a new project to replace the files and then it worked this is if that's the case we have some okay. bugs on our development it's, team to work on yeah. um, it's probably just my fault like that's a lot of things are just my fault well we will we will investigate and yeah. we will get back with you mm -hmm. um, but. We'll just pretend. You've seen all the correct steps, ironically enough. Yeah. Like, we got to the last step and did it correctly. So if you are not Andrew, <laughs> you can follow all these yeah. steps and you can see success in uploading your package. There you go. Um, so do we want to do the outline for the, the Dart Streams interface or are we going to call it good for today? Let's, let's do some, let's look at the Dart interface for, uh, for the next one. Okay. And, and do that. Okay. For yeah, so, okay. So call it quits on the uh, the publishing section here. Yeah. And we're going to switch seats, and um, we can look at some actual Dart code. All right.